On a personal note, I've known Jean Shepard virtually uh, my whole life. I feel like I've been connected to her. I, thanks to my dad being a fan, I got acquainted with her music very early on in my life. And I used to drive two, three, four, five hours sometimes each way to go watch her in concert. I was never disappointed. As a broadcaster, she was extremely kind to me before I ever came to this town. She got me jobs emceeing shows, put a lot of good words in for me behind my back that I never knew about until much later on. And those are kindnesses that you can never forget. When I came to this town in 1995, she was a huge supporter of what I did and told a lot of others about me, and I can never repay what she did for me. First Christmas I was here, she wanted to make sure that I had something to open on Christmas morning, she and Benny. They gave me a, a box that was wrapped up, and I opened it that morning in my apartment, and there were two neckties in there. I wore one yesterday to the visitation, the other I have on today in her memory. With heartfelt appreciation for those 82 years of life, 65 years as a performer, and a 60-year member of the Grand Ole Opry, I ask you to seek out the recordings, the videos, her autobiography. There's a wealth of material that all fans of country music, it's past where it is presently. And those who are yet to discover the genre in the future can learn from, be inspired by, and enjoy. 